How do I choose between morality and money in the competitive workplace? Help me. My life goal is slowly turning myself into a money-making machine. How can we not be confined by money-making, transcend the self and be broad-minded? Have an ideal, goal, motivation, and be responsible. Dreams transform one's life. Let me share a story about a renowned, admired personality. The Apple computer founder, Steve Jobs. Who is he? His true life story is. When he was young, he had more than one pursuit. Hoping to have a lifestyle of freedom, that of a hippie. One day this pursuit prompted him to visit India. He came to a very undeveloped place. Twenty years ago, the agriculture in the U.S. wasn't individual planting, but farming. Farmlands weren't tilled by horses or cows, but by machines. In India, even today, lots of land is still plowed by cows, horses, or humans. So, after Jobs left India, he made up his mind. He'd use his abilities to change the manual labor in India in the future. His youth dream was to use his wisdom to change this physical labor. Thus, Jobs' creative, reformative management style arose. When a contemporary person elevates his life goal, to change the manual labor backward way of production. What great energy and wisdom he derives from his dream. This Bodhi Meditation Youth Camp is aiming to train youth leaders. Let's take a step back from this. We're not becoming a leader. But how do we become a responsible, talented person with a life goal? Such a talented person can help society. They may not become wealthy but aim to allow all beings to have food to eat. Their mind is as broad as an ocean to transform the world. Whatever professions our parents have, however high their education is, whatever their financial condition is, it doesn't matter. Children, if you come to my class, you need to consider. Is your life pursuit about counting money or is it a noble one? Bringing humanity happiness and joy? My future is in my hands, series, keep your dream in your heart, to be continued.